মাগরিবের পরে কি তুমি নাচা করবা নাও সো ইউ উইল রাইট ইউর বুকস নাও ফিনিশ ইট বিফোর মাগরিব নাও হোয়াট ইজ দ্য বেসিক স্ট্রাকচার দ্যাট ইউ नीड टू रिमेंबर দ্য বেসিক স্ট্রাকচার ইজ এ সাব কে ইজ ইকুয়াল টু ইয়োর ফার্স্ট টার্ম সরি মাম times your common difference to the power uh, to the power k minus 1 okay this is the basic structure that you need to remember assalamu alaikum dear viewers in some of the last classes i have shown you the intro of arithmetic sequences and geometric sequences and then i've also shown you the explicit and recursive of the arithmetic sequence. Today I'll show you the uh, the explicit and recursive of the geometric sequence. But before that, let's do an intro of the geometric sequence again. So the geometric sequence, the geometric sequence. Let me give you an example: half, and then two, and then eight, right? So this is will be our sequence now. What's the common difference? The common difference is multiplying by four, right? So see, if you multiply by four right here, you will get to two. Oh, multiply by four. If you multiply by four right here, you'll get to eight. That's this. That's the geometric sequence. You keep multiplying by something. Now I'm going to show you the explicit and recursive ways that you can write this. We're gonna keep the same example. So first, you're gonna write a sub k. I've also shown you in the other episodes that. You can do other variables if you want. A sub k, k is equals to one to infinity. Okay, infinity. Okay, with first I'm gonna show you the explicit. The explicit would be with um we're gonna do a sub k is equals to your first term, which is half multiplied by your um change to the power k minus one. Okay. Now let's test it out. So a sub k. Let's say we want to figure out for the fourth term, and a times four is thirty-two. Okay, so we already know that. Now is equals to half times four to the power uh, four minus one, which would actually be three. Right. So a sub k is equals to half times. So four to the power three would be four times four is sixteen, and sixteen times four would be sixty-four. Now, we're, now we're going to do a sub k. Now that would be um, basically that would be sixty-four divided by two, and sixty-four divided by two would actually be thirty-two. So dear viewers, we actually aimed for thirty-two because eight times four was thirty-two, and we got the answer. So it works. So this is the explicit. Now, what is the basic structure that you need to remember? The basic structure is a sub k is equals to your first term. <coughs> Sorry, um, times your common difference to the power uh, to the power k minus one. Okay, this is the basic structure that you need to remember. Now I'm going to show you the recursive formula. The recursive way. Of writing this geometric sequence, there's only a little bit of change. So a sub k, um, I'm sorry, a sub one. Why one? Why one is the term right here? So the first term is half in this sequence, right? So that would be a sub one. And then a sub k. This is where the real formula starts. A sub k is equals to a. The previous term, the value of the previous term, multiplied by your common difference right here four, right? Now let's text it out. Let's say yeah we want we want to figure out the fourth one. We already know that's thirty two, and it works with the explicit. Why not? Well, let's see if it works right here. So a sub k is equals to your a so your a four minus one times four. And then a sub k. Oh, sorry. Um, dear. A sub k is equals to. That would be. A sub a of three. T 
times 4. Now a of k, a sub k is equals to a of 3 is 8, right? So that would be where 8, 8, 8 times 4. Now 8 times 4, a sub k is equals to 32. So dear viewers, it works with both the explicit and the recursive. Now I'm going to show you the basic structure that you need to remember for the recursive of this geometric sequence. And it's actually very easy. Um, there and yeah, right here. Okay. I'm going to show you the basic structure that you need to remember in order to do this. Okay, so a sub 1, yes, is equals to your first term. And a sub k is equals to a, k minus 1, your previous term, multiplied by your common difference. This is the basic structure you need to remember. So dear viewers, now you know how to write the recursive and the explicit uh, ways of the geometric sequence. So in the previous videos, I've showed you how to do it for the arithmetic. Now I just show you for the geometric. So these are some of the things that you need to know in order to master these sequences. Thank you and assalamu alaikum.